Hey guys, it's Zach, or Shinobi81Zach, and I'm going to be teaching you guys Japanese. Alright, I'm going to start you guys out with a few simple phrases, because we're going to be talking about greetings. So, I mean, I, what better way to start out than by greetings, to, you know, introduce yourself, say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, as well as farewell, at like, good night, and goodbye, and see you later. Alright, first off. Um, greetings. Alright, good morning. Ohayou gozaimasu. Alright, now just repeat that. Ohayou gozaimasu. Also, you could say Ohayou gozaimasu. Um, I mean, if you want, you can omit the u at the end in Ohayou gozaimasu. It doesn't really matter. I mean, you're, you're going to be understood either way because. I and mean, other Japanese people omit the U, depending on where they're from. Alright, also, um, okay, good afternoon. Konnichiwa. That means good afternoon slash hello. Um, good evening. Konbangwa. Konbangwa. Yep, that's good evening. And good night. Oyasumi nasai. Oyasumi nasai. Alright. Now, introductions. Alright, so you walk up to a Japanese guy, or woman, whichever. Alright, um. Or you're meeting, like, this is a planned meeting. We'll do it that way, because, I mean, you don't just want to go to some random person. Um. Alright, so you do a bow, and the bow should be, like, 45 degrees. I don't want to be specific. I mean, I demonstrated, but I'm using a webcam, so. It'd be kind of difficult. Alright, so, um. So, yeah, you do your bow. And you say, Hajime maste. Hajime ma si te. Hajime maste. Alright, and that means, like, you're meeting the person for the very first time. It's customary to say. And then you say, Namae, watashi. Hold on. Watashi no namae wa. And then your name, Des. Watashi no namae wa Zach Des. You can also say Desu, like Watashi no namae wa Zach Desu. But usually people say Des. No, Watashi no namae wa Zach Des. Alright. And then you say On namae wa. And that, and that means like, and your name. And then that person is inclined to introduce themselves to you. Alright, now, for farewells. Sayonara. That means goodbye. Sa. Yo. Na. La. And, um, see you later. Um, there are a bunch of, there are a lot of ways to say it. Um, a lot of people say, jana. You might hear a matane. Jama, see, jamata. I think I said that. Um, jamata ashita, which means I'll see you tomorrow, or see you again tomorrow, literally. Um, whichever you prefer, you can say jana if you want, ja na. Um, or mata ne, mata ne. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed that lesson. Let me know what you think about it, and. I'll, I look forward to doing another lesson soon. Sayonara!